In the beginning, in Europe, it was all road racing. As soon as cars were for sale, they were being raced along country roads, from city to city, wherever they could be driven fast. There wasn't so much distinction then between street cars and race cars. The difference was all in the men who drove them. You had to be a little bit of a daredevil to race back then, hurtling along at 100 miles an hour with nothing but goggles and nerve. Right from the beginning, it was a spectacle filled with action and accidents. As early as the 20s, thousands of people lined the courses in Europe and America. Before long, new folk heroes were born. Tazio Nuvolari, Alberto Ascari, Camille Genazzi. They hobnobbed with the rich and titled elite of the continent, swept along by the mystique of their machines. Racing changed, and the spectacle hardened into a sport, but it never quite became a science. They say it's not like it used to be, that it's all sterilized and organized, too professional. But from behind the wheel, sliding through the turns and flying down the straights, it hasn't changed a bit.